Welcome back to another video. We sincerely hope that you are having a wonderful day. If you enjoy today's presentation and find it informative, please feel free to subscribe to this channel, like the video, and share the content. Today's video subject, Can a Cat Survive on a Vegetarian Diet? Diets. They are a plenty arguably more today than ever before in recorded history. And while the vegan lifestyle is perfect for many people, attempting to transition a feline to the vegan life is not recommended. In fact, it can be very dangerous. In short, humans are flexible when it comes to food. Cats are not. Generally speaking, we can eat just about anything and get away with it, especially when we're young. Our bodies are quite forgiving. Heck, that's why for as much that has totally changed within our society, junk food remains as popular as ever. Candy bars and cockroaches, probably the only two things remaining when all is said and done. We put our body through the ringer, and generally speaking, we can roll with those punches, constantly changing and evolving. Apples one minute, a donut the next, rinse and repeat. The human body was built for the storm, as in many of our bad dietary decisions. When it comes to cats, it's all about meat. Meat-based protein, to be specific. Cats are obligate carnivores. Cats are built for it. It's all they know. And frankly, it's all the feline body can accept and tolerate on a routine basis. Cats need vital amino acids and vitamins in order to lead a healthy life. Only animal meat, rich in protein, can meet a cat's requirements. This is where the vegan diet, unfortunately, falls short of the mark. For example, Cats need taurine, an essential amino acid. It's not found in plants. Over time, a cat that is fed a vegan diet will develop a taurine deficiency because a critical component for positive health is lacking. I mentioned chocolate just a bit earlier. In the feline world, plant-based food sources are a lot like candy, a lot like chocolate. There's not much going on in terms of nutritional value. And of course, this is why, even as much as we love our junk food. Hey, we can't eat candy bars for dinner every night. They simply will not give us very much in respect to what we need, quite obviously. The vegan diet, well, it won't take a cat too far either. It should also be noted that a vegan diet can be quite high in carbohydrates. Felines are just not equipped to digest carbs. They get little to no nutritional value from carbs, and regular consumption could result in diarrhea and or vomiting. Here again, it's like candy. There's just not a lot of meat on the bone when it comes to the vegan diet, pun intended. This is one of those, hey, I didn't make the rules, I just know the law type of topics. Cats are designed for the consumption and digestion of meat. Everything they need, well, it's right there in that wet food. The concept as humans of more or less eating the same thing all the time would seem a bit weird to us. However, if you're a cat, hey, that's just how it goes. And sure, not all cat food is created equal, and there are plenty, a host, a variety of tasty flavors, but still, it's all about animal meat, rich in protein, containing all of the essentials. So, today's takeaway message, enjoy the vegan diet, but that tender chicken and that thick gravy, pop open a can of that for Garfield. He'll certainly thank you. And with all of that said, I'll now turn things right on over to you, the very best audience on the internet. Is your cat sample from the vegan menu from time to time? Just a quick one-off, if you will. Does your cat have special dietary needs due to health concerns and, you know, requires some different foods from time to time? Let's talk all about diet. If you have thoughts on this topic, please share them. Positive conversation is always welcome. It is the meat and potatoes of this community. And once again, feel free to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel if this type of content is of interest to you. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you later.